Guys, I want to talk about the best quarterback in the game. Now, if you don't have this quarterback, keep grinding. He's pretty obtainable. Uh, most people have it. You got it free with Madden if you pre order the MVP edition. That's Lamar Jackson. Uh, ability point structure is amazing this year. It's kind of like salary cap for abilities. Really puts a limit on what you can have. And if you want to sacrifice and put abilities here, there, this, that, where, whatever it may be. Um, it's really a good feature they put in the game that you you got to find the way to utilize it the best way. And honestly, most of the abilities I found this year kind of underwhelming. You know, I haven't been locked in and thinking anything is a must-have. I've tried a bunch of different things. Last year, post-flag elite with the wide receiver was unstoppable. Um, and, but this year, not, a lot of the route running chems and the catching chems, I'm not that impressed by. Um, maybe some route comes if you guys want it. I use Slot Apprentice in my Seattle playbook that's available on Madden Turf. All those links are below. But uh, for me, you got to the whole entire ship starts with the captain. The whole entire process starts with the quarterback. It's the most important position in football. It's the most important position on your mutt team. Now, let's take a look at what I think is the glitchiest, glitchiest setup that you can have for Lamar Jackson. Because people ask me this stuff all the time, like, what should I, what do you got on Lamar? How do you do, what do you set up? And I've been trying a bunch of things, but let's talk about it. Let's go into the, the screen and see. This is Lamar Jackson, the new card, the Super Bowl, MV, whatever, MVP of the, I, I don't know. But this is the 91 overall. Now, I use Go Deep. I've always used Go Deep Chem. Throw power, deep route running accuracy, because at the end of the day, who cares about short passes? Just saying. We want to go up top. Go deep. Sounds good. We use it. That's what I use. Pa it gives you pass block to him, a passer. That's the way I like. Um, Lamar Jackson. So let's go over here to attributes now. All right, he has 92 speed. Have double sprinter on the team. That's irrelevant. Sprinter is what I use. Don't bring up any other chem. Don't bring up anything like that. And these are the abilities that I got. One, the Superstar X Factor. Omaha. Uh, it shows the play art. Honestly, I don't think any of these are that amazing. The trust ability would be tough if you were running blast or something like that. Maybe um, blitz radar, nah, nah, maybe threat detect. Blitz radar, blah, 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 blah. Omaha. If you want to show me play art, Omaha. Now you need to complete six straight passes of over five yards. So you can't run six straight screens. You got to throw a couple dots. Now, I mean, it's kind of tough to unlock. Uh, but if you get it, boom, there it is. It's it's amazing. So that's what I choose to use um, Omaha. It's pretty cool to have Omaha on Lamar. But that, that part's kind of unnecessary. Now, obviously, we have Escape Artist. Escape Artist has just come out with this card. It's 3 AP. It's a lot. Now, I'll be honest. It's not OP. If you don't have Escape Artist, you can still run with the quarterback. Part of the reason why people aren't using it as much. But for me, it's still really tough. And in the meta this year, has been a lot of coverage. So having that guy that can outrun the lineman, can get 10 yards with ease, with a scramble, really important. And mo honestly, the most underutilized uh, thing about escape artists is running away and throwing the ball away and get yourself out of a bad play. That's one of the best things about escape artists. So I'm going to use escape artists. Boom. Next ability I have is quick draw. It, you get quicker throw animations with people around you. I, honestly, I don't even know if this is amazing. I've just had it on since the beginning of the game when I had Russell Wilson, and I kept it with Lamar. I think it's something I would notice more if I took it off. So I'm kind of afraid to take it off. I like quick draw. I like getting rid of the ball. It's 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 nice. You know, throw out of sacks are more accurate. Um, uh, you're less immune to sheds and pressure if you can get this quick draw ability. That's one AP. So I'm already at four AP for my quarterback. The last one I got is kind of the glitch. Is second wind. Now, we talked about escape artists, how it's kind of calmed down. The biggest reason why it's calmed down is because the stamina of the quarterback is insanely bad. You scramble for 10 yards with escape artists, you're going to be red the next play. You get tackled, take a hit stick out of bounds, anything along that nature, you are going to be absolutely exhausted. And at that point, Lamar Jackson is going to run like he, he's a center. He's not going to run like Lamar Jackson anymore. But what second wind gives you is mid-play, he's going to start rejuvenating some of his stamina. Now, this is one AP, and it kind of adds on to escape artists. Because the biggest problem I had when I first equipped escape artists is it just saps the stamina of your quarterback. It absolutely just makes him like he, like just, he can't catch his breath. You know, and what this second wind ability does is kind of neutralizes that, gives you, removes the stamina decrease 
with the escape artist so that really then now escape artist has no downside now i like this three this three ability combo on the quarterback i really do i think it's probably the most effective way to go and that's what i'm going to continue to rock on these gameplays on these films is this second wind escape artist and quick draw i mean if you guys are using any other chems let me know uh like i said i don't think any of the offensive chems are really overpowering i have two edge protectors to tackle i have slot apprentice with route tech on my slot receiver that's about it and then I, and right now i have five ability points on my man lamar jackson so that's what i think is the best combo for the best quarterback in the game and if you like videos like this breaking down my abilities breaking down my team try to help you guys get better man please hit the like button i'll continue bringing you more of these